So this is how we can start a Notion on your iPad. Let's get into it. So what you need to do at first is to locate the App Store and just open it up, look up for Notion. And from the developer of the app, there are basically two apps, the Notion and a Notion calendar. The calendar is a little bit more advanced stuff. So we're going to stick with the basic Notion. And when you open it up, you will essentially be able to like download the, the version, right? Which is the latest one on the App Store. Once you do download it on your device, you essentially have the ability to log in or add an account to your Notion from multiple different like sources. If, I mean, you can use an existing Google account, Apple, Microsoft account, you can even log in with Passkey or uh, you can even continue with email. So if you don't have anything else, you can log in with your email account of whichever kind you have. But usually a lot of people likely go with the Google or Apple option. And once you do, you essentially end up in your workspace, as they call it. And on the left panel, you have like the categories or the main pages, which you can um, organize, add, do whatever you want with them, but essentially you just tap on the plus button wherever you want and a new node will be added into that category. So it's very simple. You can, you're going to find out that after a while of using Notion, it just becomes second nature. You know, again, very simple to just uh, start organizing and nesting the pages because as you know, you can like put the pages into pages and into pages. So it works very well in that sense. I have a bunch of other videos on this channel about Notion and how you can use it and which great features are also part of it. So go ahead and check it out on this channel, but also do not hesitate with clicking on the subscribe button as I publish a lot of videos like these and I'm just going to catch you in the next one.